The Java Virtual Machine is a great piece of software and the Java ecosystem provides a lot of great libraries. Can we take advantage of them in Common Lisp? ABCL is an implementation of Common Lisp that runs on the JVM and can work with its ecosystem. This way you can build the business logic in ANSI Common Lisp and interface it with many popular libraries like graphical user interface, web servers, machine learning or database connection provided by Java. In this video I will show you how to get started with ABCL and the first impression I had. A prerequisite for ABCL is to have Java installed. You can verify if it is installed running Java iPhone version. In this case you can see that I have the OpenJDK version 17. To start using ABCL it's sufficient the Java Runtime Edition. No need for the Java Development Kit. You will need it if you actually want to build ABCL. If you miss Java, you have to look at how to install the OpenJDK on your Linux distribution. Then, to get started with ABCL, you just have to open the official site and download the binary. Extract it, and inside you will get ABCL.jar, which is the actual implementation. You can run it with Java minus jar ABCL. To set up the development environment, one has to have Slime or Sly up and running. Inside the configuration, we will have to set a single script, not something run by Java as we did before. And it has to be in your path. First of all, you have to choose a directory in your path. In my example, I will use home slash bin. First of all, I copy all the jar inside the bin directory. We need both ABCL and ABCL contrib because it provides some useful libraries. If you want to use another directory, you have to create the directory you are interested in and then set the path accordingly. Now I can set up the executable script. Now I go in the bin directory and I create a file named ABCL. What it simply does it runs Java and pass the path of the jar. In particular, I will forward all the parameters that were passed as command line arguments. Make it executable, and then we can see that wherever I am, for example, now I am in the home, I can run ABCL. Finally, I have to pass the ABCL script to the MX configuration. I'm currently using use package and we can see that as in very list program I pass directly ABCL. If I now start Sly we can see that it is currently using ABCL. I've also changed the ABCL RC file in my home in order to load the quick lisp. If you are using another environment the steps to set up the inferior list process are the same. We wrote a really simple execution script. The official docs provide a more complete one. First of all, we use this script to create a list of symbol we could be interested in having the autocomplete for. I create a file test.lisp in my home directory and I passed the script I taken from the documentation. Then I run it inside ABCL. We can see it loaded a lot of common Lisp symbols. Then we can replace the ABCL execution script with this one. I just have to change the ABCL location. In this server, we can see that the number of arguments is checked. If no command line argument was provided, means that we want to start it interactively. So it will run ABCL inside a RL wrap that provides history and some basic autocompletion. If we have provided some command line argument, it will run ABCL directly and forward the command line argument. In both cases, we are using exec that replaces the current process with the new one. If I now run abcl from the command line, 
we can see that we have auto completion and I can use the upper arrow to get the previous executed command. This is provided by RLWrap. Inside ABTL we have complete control over Java object and this is great. For example, I can define a parameter list that creates an array list and call Java methods on it. The startup currently is really slow, maybe I can optimize it. The most sad thing is that in ABCL, many warning I would expect at compile time are actually error at runtime, like calling a function with the wrong arity. I define a function foo that just takes a parameter and prints it. Then I define a function bar that calls foo without arguments. In ABCL, I would expect a warning telling me that foo is called with the wrong number of arguments. In this case, no warning is shown, but if I call bar, we can see that a signal is thrown, which is a runtime error. Wrong arguments for foo, one expected, while none provided. A common list project that is meant to be run inside ABCL should have at least two packages. The core one should only use standard common lisp and should be compiled and tested under multiple implementation like ABCL, SBCL, CCL and so on. All the interaction with the Java world are somewhere else. This is just boundary code, some glue code that will create an interface between the actual business logic written in the core and the required component from the JVM. This way we can have the best of both worlds. Our business logic will be well tested and can take advantage of the advanced type inference from SVCL, but then we can run this code on JVM. Let me know in the comments if you liked the video, leave a like and subscribe.